talk about best wrestlers. Well, you're looking at the four best wrestlers here in ACW. The ACW Heavyweight Champion, Kevin Delisco. The St. Louis Anarchy Champion, Gary J. The Ace of Anarchy, the 2013 Lone Star Classic winner, Danny Vega. And the best technical wrestler on God's green earth today, walking, Pierre Abernathy. So, I have a challenge for you if we're throwing challenges out. Four anarchists, and I don't care who you are, I don't care where you came from, four versus us. Oh my God. Every thread of reality that I thought that I had to hold on to is completely lost. Chris True was supposed to be here. Where were you, Chris? Prior engagements? Pelicans gave me crazy. I can't win a match to save my life. And everybody else here, I don't know what they're thinking. Tonight, I gotta be a leader. So watch, see how this is done. Excuse me, everybody. How are we feeling, everyone? How are we feeling tonight? You know, fire. It's actually, it's actually kind of nice. And after the night, I wasn't the one burned, but I still felt the pain of the, of the burn. It was so nice. I think, I think I know. I think I know what needs to be done. Riley started out wrestling. I had a dream of, of wrestling all over the UK. And then I went to Europe, and then I got to go to America, and it was amazing. But you know what they say about America? Everything's bigger and better in Texas. Hey you guys, hey, I'm Delala Doom. I'm here with Donnie Brooks, Dylan Dunbar. You guys, after tonight's Lone Star Classic, how do you feel moving on together as a unit? up for Brooks and Dunbar. Let me tell you, my performance tonight, irrelevant. This man right here took care of business. I did. That's what I did. I destroyed Scotty Santiago. No one is ever going to remember the name Scotty Santiago. Thanks to Dad for Dylan Dunbar. Bye, buddy. Yeah. We might as well just stop saying his name. It's irrelevant. It doesn't matter. Hey, the problem is, Carson took care of you, unfortunately. You know what? Next month, don't worry. I get my hands on Carson next month, and I promise you, dress to kill. Bring it home with me. No doubt about it. Mark it. So, are you guys ready? Ready for what? Do the interview. Can we just stand with that? What? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Shadow Mike, I don't know what. Okay. Guys, wait, hold on. You guys already cut the. Yeah. Yeah, dude, we can do it. Really, Mike? Show it too. What did you do? Uh, I don't know. Dude, what is Wait. Something new. Yeah, Mike. Might... Alright, hold on, hold on, one second, one second. I feel so good. I think you're next, Tony. You're next. You find your four best, you find three of your friends, I don't give a shit. You find us in the middle of that ring. Because <laughs> we'll be there. So here I am. Austin, Texas for Anarchy Championship Wrestling. And who's my opponent? The American Joshi Champion, Sue Young. Now, uh, I've been put in a title match, and that's great. But you know what? I'm not an American. I'm not a Joshi. But you know what I am, Sue Young? I'm a pro wrestler. How the fuck are you doing right now? This is what I need. Guys, listen. There is nothing to be disappointed about tonight. Let me introduce you to a little concept called Pirate Victory. Perhaps you've heard of it before. It means that just because we are losing out, it's part of a greater strategy. Tonight, I lost in my bid for the Lone Star Classic, but when you look at it, it doesn't even really matter. There was nothing for us to win there. It does that, that was unimportant. And so why should I have to wrestle three matches? I get it, just go out in the beginning. That's why he had Ricky Starks in that match. There's a reason for everything. Now what do you say? Why don't we bring all of these bad times around and bring about 
the glorious age of the business. What do you say? We're gonna get hungry and we're gonna forget our manners. Yeah, baby. What's this? Two Jeff from Santa. Oh my goodness, it's not even Christmas yet. Holy, look at this Ultimate Warrior. I love Ultimate Warrior. A WWE magazine with Batista. I don't even think he wrestles there anymore. But oh my, oh man. Best of Killer Cash. Wait a second. There's nothing in there. There's no such thing as the Best of Killer Cash. <laughs> Fuck you, Santa. You know, they asked me, Jack, how do you grow such a glorious beard? And I tell them to shut the fuck up. Uh, guys, you know how long it's been since I've played with the fire? <laughs> poor, poor Sky de Lacrimosa. He just got in my way. I really am sorry, Chavez. It was supposed to be for him. The flame. myself and I'm gonna cover myself in a cocoon and when I come out I'm going to be once again the tag team champions of anarchy <laughs> I can see it now hey, you... Alright Joe you ready? We're gonna uh, I'm standing here right now with uh there was a nerve this this inner this inner already oh, wait something yeah there was something what do you want me to do? Oh, we were doing a promo. The flame was supposed to be for him, and he moved. And we'll get him. We'll all get him. And I'm going to show you that you don't need any cheap, cutesy gimmicks to get ahead in this business. I'm going to show you that it's all about skill and determination. So if these fans love you, that's fine. Have them on your side, because I've got everything I need right here. The Fighting Irish, Rio O'Reilly is coming to show Texas what fighting's really about. <laughs> All right, boy. I need you. What do you say? Are you on board? <laughs> Excellent. Big Ricky, I know I can count on you. So, what we have learned tonight is that we are going to focus our synergistic energies once again on winning the tag team titles. Right? Right, gang? Right. 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 <laughs> All right, let's focus up. Is it going to be anything childish about what we do in December? There isn't a four-person team walking the earth that could beat us, not tag team wrestling. And there damn sure isn't in this company. So we'll see it. 